Hello, and welcome to this video tutorial on how to register for your AHIMA Virtual Lab. In this video, we will show you the steps to follow in order to set up your Virtual Lab account. First, let's review the steps. You will receive an email with a link to the AHIMA website. Clicking the link will take you to the website where you will enter your Indiana Tech email address. Then, the website will send you a new user ID and password. The message will be sent to your Indiana Tech email, so check your email. You will return to the AHIMA website and enter your new user ID and password. At this point, there will be several fields for you to enter your personal information. When you're finished with that, you will be prompted to create a new password. You will have an opportunity to review and edit your personal information. And finally, you will click the Create User button, and you're done. Now, let's get started with the registration process. This is the email with the link to the Virtual Lab website. Save this email because you will need the link later to complete the registration. Clicking the link shown will take you to the website and begin the registration process. Since we do not have a user ID or password, we will click here to skip this step. Enter your Indiana Tech email address and click Continue. They will send your new user ID and password to the address you provided. When you receive your new user ID and password, go back to your original email message and use the link to continue your registration. Clicking this link will take you to the website. Enter the new user ID and password and click Login. At this point there will be several fields for you to enter your personal information and your work information. When you are finished entering that information, you will be prompted to create a new password. You will have an opportunity to edit your personal and work information. Finally, you will click the Create User button and you're done. The Virtual Lab website will display a confirmation and your new user ID number. Be sure to print this page and retain it for your records. You will also receive an email telling you that you have been added to your school's virtual lab roster and your account will be activated in one business day.